Hey guys, my name is Sri. I'm the Herschel Smith Scholar for 2019-2020 and I just wanted to give you a brief overview of how it is to study at Harvard for a year. I did uh, a BA in Natural Sciences at Cambridge specializing in physics and then I came to Harvard for a one-year program under the special students. I've been taking some graduate courses in physics and I've been working at the lab at the Doyle Group. My advice to prospective applicants is to reach out to professors and really talk to them about the kind of research that you're interested in and how the lab works. Harvard provides an, an amazing opportunity. So really enjoy the freedom you have to work in the lab and um, also the wide selection of courses Harvard has to offer. Hi guys, I'm Will. I graduated from Cambridge with an undergraduate in Geography. And I'm here this year doing a mixture of international law foreign affairs uh, and international relations. It's a great year, great experience. You're able to choose so widely across all the different schools. So I took papers in the Law School, Kennedy School, and also in the Faculty of Arts and Sciences. And that's one of the great things about the program, is you're able to pick and choose across a wide range of areas and really get a chance to explore areas you couldn't cover in your undergraduate degree. Some words of advice if you're thinking of applying, definitely go for it because you get a great chance to explore America, to meet a lot of international students in the graduate schools. So the advantage of having wide choice across all the departments um, is one of the great benefits of the program. But it means that unlike Cambridge, you haven't got a set program. You have to really decide for yourself which areas you want to pursue. And in some ways, the chip of choice can be overwhelming. To avoid feeling like you have way too much choice, I'd recommend really deciding what you want to get out of the year uh, and focus on hitting those areas while you're here. One other thing to mention, the terms are much longer here. They're about 12 weeks in total, and the nature of the work is more um, continuous assessment, whereas in Cambridge it all comes at the end of the year. Something to bear in mind when you're planning your time and other activities that you might want to get involved in uh, while you're in the States. Uh, my name's Tom, I study physics at Emma, and since coming to Harvard, I've uh, been spending my time uh, taking classes and doing research in theoretical neuroscience and machine learning. This is definitely one of the most incredible things about the Herschel Smith uh, scholarship and the opportunity to come to Harvard. You have so much flexibility and you're totally able to take what you learned at Cambridge uh, and apply it to a brand new field. A year ago, I'd have never thought that I'd be doing neuroscience now. There's certainly some advice that uh, I'd like to give. It's not an easy year and there's uh, so many opportunities that it's quite easy to take too much on. Uh, Harvard opens a lot of doors and you're likely to uh, be considering applying for PhDs. Uh, or jobs, and this takes a lot of time. There's also a lot of extracurricular activities, and these, this adds up, and all of a sudden, it's, uh, you've got a lot on your plate. So you've got to manage your time carefully, and think carefully about what you're taking on at the start of the year. In general, it's been like a really super year. I've had a lot of fun, and you should definitely apply if you're keen to come to the US for a year. I hope that's given you a good overview of our year at Harvard, and what an amazing experience it's been. We're grateful to Mandel College for providing us with the opportunity to study at Harvard, and uh, feel free to reach out to us if you have any other questions.